Sarah, and today on Your Story TV as part of a lead up to our Startup Jobs Fair, we're at Fusion Charts to feature their office. Fusion Charts is one of the biggest success startup stories coming out of India, and they're in 118 different countries around the world. Fusion Charts helps you make data delightful. With the catchphrase of don't be boring, be delightful, let's check out their workplace. And today we have Badisha. She's gonna she's managing HR for Pan India for Fusion Charts and she's gonna help us tour Fusion Charts office today. Thank you for joining us today. Pleasure. So tell us a little bit more about Fusion Charts and how long you've been here. I've been here for a little over one and a half years and um, Based on my experience, well, I have around eight years of experience, and this is one of the best companies I've worked with. You talk about the culture, you talk about the madhouse, your work, everything rocks. So, Fusion Chats is the place to be. This is our discussion room, right? We have a policy of not taking any calls on the floor, so you got a call from your girlfriend, you got a call from your parent, you got a certain idea which you need to write down. This is the room. So, be it a graffiti or some idea or a structure or whatever it may be, this is the discussion room. And when the lunch room is not vacant, feel free to have lunches here. Right? So how big is the team here? We have around 23 people here mm -hmm. in Bangalore and we have around uh, 35, 40 people in Kolkata. Our total strength is around 60. Wow. Uh -huh. yeah. So what do we have in here? This is our support room. Hey guys. That's our support team. That's Sumeet. His smile is always like that, right? <laughs> and he never compromises on his smile. And that's Shashi, that's Harika. These three are a part of our support team. That's Arjun. Hi. Arjun has recently joined us and he is a part of our sales team. Uh, that's Som. He is the man who keeps the place going. So you need a laptop, you need a keyboard, you need anything in this world, Som is your man to be. Yeah? And uh, that's Jade. He keeps our laptops and computers running. So you got a virus problem, your computer is not booting, Jadev yeah, is your man. Very nice. So what makes it so great to work here? What's the culture like at Fusion Charts? Actually, you are making happy the clients. Mm -hmm. We are the customer happiness engineer as a daily message. Mm -hmm. So whatever the issues client is facing with this product, we are uh, trying to fix that issues. Normally, uh, as a customer happiness engineer, we are doing that. So what's the best part about working here? So, flexibility. Mishka heads our operations and our support team and our IT, right? So, so what makes it different to work here? What's the culture like at Fusion Charts? <coughs> oh, flat hierarchy. So, you know, very easy to approach the VCU. You know, he sits amongst us. In fact, I have a bigger cabin than what he has. He works in a sense of a workstation. Very approachable people. Uh, so that's one of the you know, main advantages you have. Otherwise, in other companies, you have to follow a chain of command. That's absolutely not there. And we ensure that each one of us is also approachable by others. So open door policy, no problems at all. And um, one of our main concerns is to make uh, life easy for everyone else. So whatever it is, once you are in the office, we take care of you. Whether it's you know, providing IT infrastructure, whether it's providing any other facilities you would require. Cool. Thank you for talking to us. That is our director communications and UX. Hey, Yoda. So, what makes the company culture different here from other places you've worked? It's fun. Fun, fun, and more fun. Can you give me an example of why it's fun? The best part, part of the job is we get into fist fights almost every single day about what feature to do, what design we need to hold, what kind of people to hire, where. Pretty much we start everything in the fight and the right spirits. <laughs> and you like that part of the company culture? I guess so most of the services firms you treated like probably you know, all of it spreadsheet and then you assign it on all the value. But here we just give a lot of responsible for what you want. So it's basically a perspective. I love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, sure. before that's Agastya and that's Rahul. They're all part of our sales team. So can you guys tell us what makes it so great to work at Fusion Charts? Uh, well I think it's the whole uh, exciting part of being in Fusion Charts is that it's uh, it's like working out of home, right? So, so you can see this, this small workplace, you get to meet, interact with the top bosses who don't uh, really wear a coat and a tie and give you directions. So 
Uh, and, and, and in a way, it's a very the informal product, work. Well. The product is in great demand, so it's it's easier for us to work over here. Mm -hmm. And so the best part is we stay about five hours in office, and that's the great part. That's the greatest part. We only have to stay about five to six hours in office, mm -hmm. and then we go home and work. So mm -hmm. um, our boss has given us space as to work from home. So he trusts us. That's uh, Sharath, and this is Twain. Twain heads our marketing, and uh, Sharath is a headhunter who is currently helping hey. us recruit. So tell us the challenges, tell us some of challenges. To start off with Fusion Chats, one of the best places I've worked until now. I have about four years of work experience, mm -hmm. but Fusion Chats being the best place to work around. Uh, people are very nice, fun loving, but hunting wise, work wise, pretty tough to find uh, good talent. Expectations are too high, but that's natural to have a good talent in your organization. So it's a very good place to work though. Definitely. So, what is it like to work with a startup? Do you like that kind of environment and everything that Fusion Charts has going on here? Uh, the environment is good, learning is good, and being a startup, they also learn from you, and uh, you also tend to learn a lot of new things. Uh, it's been about six months I've joined them and uh, it's totally different. I've come from a different picture to a different picture. So uh, this gives a very good understanding and good knowledge to me also. Yes, I think uh, I like a lot more working here. I think there's uh, a lot of freedom about how uh, you get stuff done. There's a lot of freedom about how you get it done. You have a different way of doing it and it's encouraging to do it that way. I like that freedom, uh, the autonomy that's there. And yeah, lots of lots of good things. There's a lot of, uh, the communication is very open. And yeah, there's a lot of other good things. There's great snacks. <laughs> so yeah, there's a lot of good loads of good things. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So uh, this is our boardroom, and most of the meetings happen here. If you want to kill someone, if you want to throw out an idea, this is the room to be. And there is a meeting in progress, so we're gonna barge in, and that's our sales director, Anand Anand Krishnan. So my name is Anand uh, Krishnan and I'm part of the sales team here at Fusion Charts. It's great, it's a startup. What's the most exciting part about your job? I could do anything that I want and you know, I could still make a difference. So, so that's, that's probably really exciting. I don't have to fill out forms and get permissions and you know, get approvals and do none of that. You know, I can do what is right. And, you know, get away with it. Is this the first startup you've worked for? Yeah, this is not. This is not. <coughs> not How does this one compare to other ones or other one you might have worked for? Um, I think there are, you know, pluses and minuses to any place uh, that you work for. Uh, obviously, Fusion Charts has its strengths. Uh, you know, uh, we work out of two different locations. So we work out of Bangalore. Uh, for a startup, to be working out of two different locations, there are also issues that come with that because you want a more cohesive environment when you're working. Uh, you know, with like a startup kind of a team where things have to move fast, and you know, you pretty much want to tell a person something, and then you have to kind of you know call them and you know get people on conference calls and everything and there are times when things break apart because something is not working and you have to move fast so all those things happen but that, that's also the good part of the entire thing right as in how often do you get startups working from multiple locations and you know things moving uh, still fast and that's really exciting too. i love all these graphics on the wall yes this is the first thing which was getting in place after we started our bangalore office design the graphics one you know, That's the color. evolution of our dude character. The dude. Uh, yeah. yeah, it's called the dude. The dude. The, the dude. Yeah. This guy is the dude. That's our mascot. That's our yeah. mascot. This is Shamashish. Yo. Yo. <laughs> Shamashish, talk about yourself. What do you do? Basically, I do nothing. I sit around just to see others work. That's ping others, best. poke others. Ping others, poke others, especially with each other. Good. Yeah, and cry, cry and say, uh, how can anybody work in a start? And then work on it throughout the day. I mean, oxymoron of the day. So what's your job title? Um, I'm the architect. It's one of the smartest kids, oh. you know, Fusion Charts has. As an uncle kid, whatever you would want to say, yeah, but that's, that's it. <laughs> yeah. What is the culture like here about Fusion Charts? Let's come down here. Okay. So. Okay, I'm, I'm from the Calcutta office. So, okay. So, he's the guy. So, we are all, uh, this is Chan, and there is an engineering team that we have out here. And 
and we basically work and uh, defining culture is difficult so we just work together as a family so it mat matters i mean it doesn't matter like whether we set anything as such as culture or not what in a sense, like working at a startup will be a lot different from working in a corporate environment. So what we're trying to showcase is how great startup environments can be because of the flexibility, um, easy access to the management. So is that something you see at Fusion Chart as well? Mm, the corporates scared us so much that we didn't join a corporate ever in our lives. So we don't know how scary it can be. Why did you guys make that decision to only work for startups? Did they scare you? Um, a little bit, yes. <laughs> we wanted to work. Yeah. <laughs> so that's the reason I think we chose startups. To create something, to make a difference and learn and the express ourselves. Here is in a startup. Like you learn so much. So. Once that's that's one, yes. one reason I have to give for working in a startup now. Like the, as I as we would say, the base. I mean, the most important part of freedom is to take a just judgment and decision by yourself. So we don't have, you know, processes, paperwork, and things that, you know, work around you. You just tell it what you need. So how many people are you guys looking to onboard between here and Kolkata? Uh, in the next two quarters, we're looking for around. At least 10 to 15 team members across teams, which includes our sales, our technical and non technical teams. Okay. Have you had good luck finding, or it's, it's is it more like challenge. a picture? <laughs> <laughs> it's been a challenge, but then yes, we found good people as well, good candidates as well. So it's been a mix and match for cases. Yeah. So let me introduce you to Selvan and Vikram. Guys, those are coders, the black screen. <laughs> What's the best part of working for Fusion Charge for you? For me, the best part is how uh, like, I just joined like what, four or five months ago. I'm like I'm a recent graduate, but still I get a, a chance to be a part of the design discussions, and I have an equal say in what frameworks or what libraries we choose or how the design flow goes. Uh, so that's something that you would find in like many companies. Since you've been here for four to five months, were you working at a startup before this, or? Before this, I was working with uh, another company. I was in a startup. What's the difference? Like, do you like it more? Do so you like it more working for a startup, or do you wish you worked yeah. more in the corporate side? I like working here more because here, I, here, there's more work than process. And back then, in big companies, there's more of the processes than work, and you always have these people over you who. Give you absolutely no freedom to choose whatever you want. You just have to play by the rules. Choose whatever. But here you got complete freedom to like choose whatever stuff you want. Just build it and ship it. Cool. Thanks for coming here. Want to see our lunch room? That's that's like a small room where we at times have our meetings, at times have our lunch. We have a TV just in case you're super bored for the day. You can just plug in some music, play a movie, work while the movie is on, whatever. You know, nobody will question you. I think that's one of the best part about startups. It's just freedom to yes. If you can work for five hours in the office, you need to be in the office. You can be in the office. That's but like true. you can work from home. You can work from home as long as the working. Time. That's that's one of the most important things. You know the flexibility and the freedom which you get. You know, that really makes a difference. Yep. So here we have the CEO. Hello. <laughs> you know what all this is about. So can you give us a little bit about why you decided to start Fusion? Okay. Make it's as simple as that. I was running short of pocket money. I hated to go back to my dad every single week. So I said, okay, let's build a company around uh, what I like. Uh, got into entrepreneurship accidentally, but hey, here we are. Been running it for 10 years. Very nice. So how do you build the culture? After speaking with all your employees here, they really like that you sit out with all of them or the work started environment, not as structured as the normal corporate environment. Mm -hmm. How have you ensured over the past 10 years that you've built this environment? Oh, very simple. Taking people who understand this and let them do their job and try not to interfere in between. So that way most of my guys, um, some of them are from big companies, but most of the guys here, uh, they have not worked in big companies and that's why they do not bring in the um, the negative aspects of the big companies. A couple of my senior guys, they are ex-entrepreneurs themselves, so uh, that helps us bring in the entire entrepreneurial and the startup culture in this company. So what's the future like, Fusion Charts? Where do you want to go next? Uh, keep doing what we're doing, better end, 
every single year. So I think we've just scratched, we've just started scratching the surface right now. And uh, there's so much more data which is being generated in the world. There's so much more. There are so many more devices which are coming in this world, uh, and everybody's getting more and more custom to good data visualization. So I think uh, what we've done in the last ten years is just set the framework, the basics right for us. Uh, how we take this forward is something which is uh, very exciting. That is something which is keeping me awake in the night. It must feel like a big form of gratification. I saw the picture on the wall of Obama. Tell me a little bit about that. How did all that happen? Accidentally, I was out uh, again. A lot of serendipity happens when you just keep on doing what you want to do. So, uh, US government is a big customer for us, so they were using our products for some of their data visualization uh, in, in the public websites. And one of these uh, websites um, was inaugurated by President Obama himself. And we were lucky to get a picture of that. Somebody took a picture and posted it in the White House government website. So, that has been one of our biggest marketing gimmicks since then. Definitely. So, how did the dude come about? Where did you get that idea? So, uh, we, so actually, when we came to the Bangor office, we said, "What can we do different?" Um, so, for us, we have a very strong belief uh, that uh, our customers should know or should remember us more than uh, more than just about our products. They should remember us for multiple different reasons. So, every small thing that we do is connected to our delight story. So, dude was a part of that delight story where we said that what can we do different so that when customers look at us, even if they forget our products, they at least remember us for one small thing. So, that's how we said, okay, let's make a mascot and let's make a funny one at that. So, uh, that, came, uh, that came in, uh, this was in 2011 when the dude came in, and ever since then, he has been a personification of everybody, everyone in the team. Very cool. Thank you for talking to us, that's the vlog. Thank you. Hey, Sunkey. Hey. Hello. So tell us a little bit about yourself and what you do at Fusion Charts. So right now, part of at Fusion Charts, she calls me a step employee. And previously, I was heading marketing and sales at Fusion Charts. I'm actually Palav's brother, so I've seen the company grow right from the shared bedroom that I actually grew up from. And right now, I just take care of the marketing part. So I spend half my time with Dada, half you know, just hanging around, drinking their coffee, uh, <laughs> things like that. And also just just looking out for other ideas. But yeah, mostly on the marketing side of things. And uh, what I like about Fusion Charts. It's, it's, it's fun, like most of the people are young, uh, feels like home, I mean yeah, there are like you know I can just sit at home and do my work but you know I like I much prefer coming down over here, I can wear my shorts, I can eat whatever I want, I can sit down and read a book, watch a movie, do whatever I want, essentially it feels like home, like you know working out from here and the people are young so it's always a lot of fun, like you know a lot of fun discussions in the evening are a lot of fun, uh, people are ready to get into fist fights, you know just you know to be able to get their ideas through someone has a better idea so people are ready to get into fist fights things like that so I think I think just that everyone is really really passionate about what they do so I think that that helps a lot and the people who are not so young are actually very young at heart so you know it all adds up I love it thank you Thank you so much for joining us today on Your Story TV and check out our startup jobs fair coming up. Bye guys!